in the following episode, I will not go to any levels. That was kind of expected. Welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. I am Crazy Kirby97, and in the last episode, we finished up Treasure Trove Cove, which is an awesome level. So, in this episode, we're going to be looking around Grunty's Lair a little bit. So, since we can use a shock spring, yeah, since we can use a shock spring now, uh, jump up here, and. Okay, I made it! And, uh, there's five. We need five to get it. That's a lot. But not too much for us. If you want to place all your pieces into the picture, just press Z. And that's what we're going to do from now on. And the third level, which I will record tomorrow, probably. I do not. Okay. Anyone knows me well, they'll know I absolutely detest Plankers Cavern. It is the worst level in the whole fucking game. But you know what? We're going to get used to it. So, you probably saw what Plankers Cavern is. Now, we need uh, 180. We have 200, so we can go in here. We're just going to open it up. We're not going to go in right away. Not right away, at least. We can pretty soon. We will, actually. But I just want to do some other stuff real quick. I want to first go up here. And we're going to build a lot of puzzles in this episode, just for the record. Uh, I want to make that clear with you guys. And I want all of you to understand that. Press this switch right here so that these come up. Make sure those are always always out. I can't talk today. I don't know why. Or I can't talk and it sounds like crap. And my neck feels a little painful from all this LP. Oh my god, I hate that. That's why I went like, head down like that. Okay, that was actually good. My neck is like tightening up a little bit as well. Happens all the time. Oh wait, by the way. Uh, get out of there, Jesus. I always forget this one, so I'm gonna get it right now before I forget. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. There you go. Why am I a cowboy all of a sudden? Hello there, young one. I'm Runtil Dog, Runtil the nicest sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets, and I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. Remember them well, young ones, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. Press B if you'd like to hear them. Yes, do it. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't really care. So, they change every time you make a new file, so you're going to have to memorize them all. So, uh, yeah. Make sure you memorize all those. I personally prefer just writing them all down. And, uh, they help a lot. So, whatever you can see, I just write them down. It's, uh, it's really, I'll show you what words to write down specifically, so you know what answer you're looking for. Monsters chase you, they are hounding. Then you'll get the Grunty's pounding. A Grunty pounding. Whatever. So right here's another level. Wow, already. We're not gonna go in there right away though. This is one of my favorite levels in the game, by the way. I love Bubble Goop Swamp. And it's kinda sad if we'll do it next. But it is the best level in this game. It is amazing. The music there is classic and the design is lovable, but we're not gonna go in there. And honestly, that was one of the more hard levels to find. And it's kind of sad that you don't actually get to see the level. You don't get enough notes. Treasure Trope Go. Slash Bubbles Mountain. Slash Clunker's Cabin. Clunker's Cabin. Why did I call it Clunker's Cavern? That was weird. I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna go up here, kids! Down here. Down here. Down here. Up here. And. This is Gratilda's giant statue of death, doom, destruction, and a couple of other things that I like more. Um, up here is a room. That's a good description. So, this is actually, you know what? We're not going to go into it. I was going to go in there and get a move real quick, but we're not going to do it because I don't want to. And honestly, if that's the case, there's really no reason to be in here. Okay, so you saw a little spoiler. That was about all. Uh, someone just banged at my door to jump. Okay. I was like, what the fuck? Get out of my way, bitch! That was, that was actually kind of funny. 
I made comedy. Up here, the do door we cannot open until we complete Clanker's Cavern. Ouch. Okay. That wasn't that bad. So, in the next... No, oh, I can't end it now, can I? No, there's probably more to look at. Come on, Banjo, there's gotta be more. You know what? You know what? I actually have an idea. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna spoil the next level a little bit. Just a little bit, though. And what we're gonna do is, I always do this every time I play this game. And what you wanna do is you wanna go into the Bubble Hoop Swamp just for a second. We're not gonna show too much. I'm only gonna go to the little back area there. And there's one move you wanna get there. Actually, the only move there you wanna get. And it's because you're gonna use it in Runky's Lair for something that takes place before the level itself. So, I don't know why they did that. Uh, it's a stupid move, guys. It's time consuming, but it is important, so let's do this. Keep your eyes open for your new move, beat face. Right here. So, I guess they kind of expect you to come in and grab it real quick. These are the wading boots. Chicken legs, there's as you can safely wade through dangerous areas like the swamp for a limited time. Wading boots, sorry. Okay, chicken or er, kazooie, let's go grab a pair. Great, now you know all the swamp's new moves. I almost said wadding. I said wadding boots, I meant wading boots. I'm, I'm not an expert on swamp stuff. Mm -hmm. Banjo Kazooie Broke Back Mountain Edition. Nope, get near me. Fuck you. Oh shit. This is Piranha Watcher. Keep your smelly feet out. Grab your fancy little boots. And, uh, we're not gonna use these until Bubble Poop Swap, except this time. But, um, I'm grabbing them just so we can get something out of the way. It's two things out of the way, really. One of them I'm not really gonna complete, though, I guess, since I don't have enough jiggies. But, uh, I might have enough jiggies, I don't know. What do we got? Eight might work, might be able to get in. Might. I'm probably not. You know what? I'm gonna go in here and it's gonna be like, you need eight? Wait, I actually need eight? What the hell? Seriously, guys? What? I need eight? That's it? Really? Okay. So that's the fifth level of the game. We already got fifth level opened up. We've only done two. We already got the fifth one open. So you can see how fast this game progresses, but we can't actually go in there if we wanted to, so... We don't actually have an entrance to that area. But we have an entrance up here, and what this is, this leads to a little secret room. But you're gonna break this, you're gonna notice that you grab a gold feather, and you look, and it's too small. What the hell? So before you guys got that, before you guys ask why the hole's too small and you can't go in there, why Rare is probably an idiot for programming that, uh, actually there's a secret to getting in there, and it's one of their little cryptic puzzles I thought would be fun to make. And it actually is a very smart puzzle. And you actually have to do it three times in this game, but the other two we don't have to worry as much. Well, actually, it's, one, it's well, actually one of three items. There's like two in this game. But this, the second one's not as hard. Long as it's and strong of our critique of blasting charm. So actually, what I really mean is, you have to do this once, this method once. But what you find there, you're going to find three times with the challenge. And what, basically, I'm going to explain how you get that small whore. Ho whore? Small whore, yes. Banjo's doing it. City style. Okay, anyways. How do you get that small hole is you need to get the transformation from Mumbo in this level. I'm not gonna not really spoiling anything, just saying there's a transformation, that's obvious. But uh what it is will not be spoiled until it is time for that. So I wanted to kill you. I I just I, I had nothing better to do. Just make some time for this episode. Thank you! That's how you waste five minutes. Except I only wasted like ten seconds. So, uh, let's call it quits. See you next episode, guys.